I'm just going to do a separate intro to this video, um, or another one even, so you'll see the next intro in a minute. Um, saying that this is the video that I was going to record and was going to come out last week. However, this is the video uh, where I was recording it and then my computer died. So that is why there is a dodgy cut halfway through to me sounding absolutely normal to me sounding like this. And I'll explain it in the video, but um, I'm just saying now that a lot of the things that I say in the video aren't relevant. Um, I haven't actually watched the clip back yet. Uh, I may say some things about the end of Dragon Fire that was cancelled. We still haven't done that yet. Uh, because a lot of people couldn't do it, and I couldn't do it, Andrew couldn't do it, so we just cancelled it. Um, it will be done soon. Um, so, yeah, um, enjoy the video. That's good. Hey guys, welcome back to another episode on the Chameleon Craft server. I have done a lot since last episode. I have actually done a bit of terraforming and um, farming and making stuff look a bit nicer. Um, I mean, I had this weird dodgy farm thing here for a while and I thought, you know, let's make it pretty. So I put some fences here. It's not very even, um, but this kind of gives you an idea of how I'm going to have the base set out. I'm going to have um, not the same path idea at spawn, the gravel cobblestone spaced out, you know, so it's a vague path going to places. Um, but I really like this, it's really, really nice. And then, I'll show you, I got an idea. I thought when I have a waterfall running down in here, then into this, so there's a waterfall coming down. And I found this in here, and I thought what I could do with this in the future, not today, is um, make it kind of like a a cave, like a water cave. I'm not sure what they're called, but they're vines everywhere. Like, really make it look really cool with bushes, and maybe crack cobblestone, cobblestone, crack stone, whatever. All around, they look quite nice. I th I'm not sure what they're actually called. I'll have to look it up. Um, but yeah, this is what I've been doing off camera. I've been doing this while watching Breaking Bad, which is a really weird combination. Minecraft and Breaking Bad does not work well together. Anyway, in today's episode, I want to do two things, two main things: one small and one kind of medium-ish, but a big project. I have slime balls now. I think I have enough. If I don't, that's going to be embarrassing. Um, but I want to make the launch pa launch pad out of my base. So, please have enough. I got 18, sweet. So, I only need. Um, I should need some pistons. I only need 9. 10 I need, because I need one for my piston as well. So, let's get some wood. Get some cobblestone. You probably might be able to guess what I'm going to be doing for the second part of the episode from the items in my inventory. Uh, I'll give you a couple of seconds to guess. If you guess, you get a gold sticker. Oh my god, what, what am I on about? You guys, you guys, you get a little gold sticker. There you go, sticky piston, and then make a slime ball. Slime ball. There we go. And I think I'm gonna go with. I'm gonna go with stone brush plates, just in case someone drops an item on it and glitches it out. Uh, that person being me. Uh, so I need four. One, two, three, four. Actually. Let's show you these. I've been doing a lot of enchantments um, on level 1 books, and I'm trying to get to a sharpness 5 sword. I've got to a sharpness 3. Um, you just run out of level so quickly, just trying to get like one type of book. Um, but I did manage to get a efficiency f uh, 5 book, which is good. And I'm going to try and get the uh, highest unbreaking book as well. I think it's 3, because I've wasted quite a few diamonds just you know, enchanting level 30 um, pickaxes all the time. So I'm thinking just making books would be easier. Uh, what else do I need? I need, uh, I think it's note blocks as well. I suppose I could do furnaces. Furnaces might look a bit cooler than note blocks, but then... Hmm. Okay, now I'm going to get a note blocks, because that means every time someone enters my base, it will make a noise. So I need wood, which is in here. Uh, that wood will be good. There we go. Oak wood. And I think, I haven't made one of these in ages, I only need four. Hey, no block. Yes, no block. And is that it? Think that is it. Let's see if I've got a spade in my tools chest. Uh, okay, I've got two iron shovels. Let's just put these together. Seventy-seven blocks to mine. That's fine. Okay, so that means I can finally get rid of this stupid ladder that's been here. There we go, and then we put. Actually, I'm going to do the redstone before I place the blocks. 
Uh, so, fortune pick. I might as well get this coal while I'm here. Like so. Do, do, do. Um, I've got a few plans, if you want to know, for uh, episodes in the future. I've actually got them all written out on a like a little document. Because I've got some really good ideas for some things I want to build on the server. At the moment, I've been recording things in really random orders. So, you might see people writing things in the chat that have already happened. Hint, hint, if you've been looking at the chat. Um, okay, so it'll go there. That means we go like this. I'm not very good at talking and doing redstone on camera. I think that's it. And I'm just going to do these all cobblestone because it's uh, a bit neater. I'm not going to get that coal. I think I'm rich on coal anyway, so that's fine. Two, three, four. Then note block. One, two, three, four. And then put the slime block there. Oh my god! It makes a noise. That's cool. Right, okay, so those actually make quite nice noises. Uh, stone pressure plate. Oh. oh, this annoys me now. I've got to freaking place that back so they're all the same note. That won't last long. People are just going to come along and do that all the time now. Two, three, four. Okay, please work. It actually works. Yes, and that means I will no longer take damage. Oh. oh. Oh, actually, no, I didn't take much damage. That's fine. So, the only problem with this design is if you walk on it straight, you glitch out. Because by the time you're actually on the uh, pressure plate, uh, the block is already up. So, you have to go on diagonally. Uh, which, is, which is not too bad. Occasionally, it doesn't work. It does if you kind of hold forward. You know, it's, it's a bit hit and miss, really. For some reason, it's only working one, uh, one, uh, one way. I will get used to this. So it works that way. Hmm. Yeah, what? Well, that's going to be a bit of fun. Screw that. Yes. Yeah, yes. Yeah, screw having this ladder here. That's it. That's going to be a bit of fun. That's going to be cool. Anyway, on to the next part of the actual episode. And I have been watching quite a bit of uh, Zistu, um on the Minecraft server. If you don't know who he is, uh, I recently had him at my base. That sounds weird. Um, come on, get come out, get out. Damn it, get out. I'll, I'll just meet you at spawn when I get out. What do you guys think of these bushes? Because I got bored and thought, you know what, I've got a bit of spare time. Got a load of bushes, got a load of fences. I'm going to uh, I'm gonna decorate the place with it. So this is what I uh, I did. I just came around, placed a load of bushes and... Yeah, I think they look quite nice actually. It makes the place look a bit more sophisticated, is that the right word? A bit more neater I suppose as well. Um, what is this? This looks, uh, this looks interesting. Mine. It looks like a mine. Ooh. Potions. So I believe this is Messenger. He told me to, um, go check it out. Oh, hey. I'm inside you. Don't mind me. That's pretty cool. Um, anyway. So... I want to make a map room on the server. A map room so people can see where everything is and um, how to get to it and so on. I'm thinking maybe up here. This is a nice area to do it, I think. However, if you look at the base uh, or the spawn even from the sky, um, I'll show you. Um, it does that place does look like a possible place to have a um, another path going off to kind of a nicer area and I'll show you that once I get up to the top of GT Towers because he's made it the biggest freaking thing in the whole like I think it's the biggest thing in the whole world actually at the moment so if you if you see the way it's kind of it's like a grid almost yeah you've got the square of spawn path that way path that way path that way and it look it would look really nice if a path went off that way so I think maybe there would be not actually a great place to put uh, the map although if we didn't have a path there I don't you know It'd be a perfect place because I do have something I want to build there that's quite big. Um, and I think that's quite a nice place to do it. Maybe at... Oh, hang on. That's the spawn town. Spawn hut. I mean, maybe I could do it in there, but not a lot of people go in there at the moment. It's literally just uses the portal room. God, this is this is difficult. I'm going to have a little scout around and uh, try and choose where to build this thing. Aha, now I think I may have just found a good spot. Um, 
while looking for the like, the place to build and talking to the guys in the chat, it turned out Messenger actually was going to build one, um, but he hadn't done it yet, and I just said that, you know, I've got the materials on me, so it'd probably be a bit easier. This here looks like a nice place, because it's just, like, just down from spawn. A lot of people use this area, use the farms and so on. It's not out the way, it's not, like, in the way, it's quite out the way. So if I get rid of these... And uh, let's destroy these, get rid of the fence, and then push the land mass back uh, that's next to me on the right. Push it back a bit to flatten it out, maybe to there. That might work quite well. It's actually an odd number as well, so that's that's always good. And oh, that's from the first farm that we made, Andrew and I, on like day one. <laughs> Sad time when you get rid of the first block of water. I don't know what I'm on about. Anyway, so this looks like a really nice place to do it. Right here. And I'm going to put um, cobble there to start. Oh, God, I don't know. You know what? We'll just do we'll, we'll just do stone bricks. Stone, you can't go wrong with stone bricks. Um, so I think we'll do it. Um, I'm not so sure about that. Okay, we'll just hit. Yeah, into the wall, I think. And I may have to get some granite as well to put on those stairs because that does look a bit weird like that, and um, with all the dirt and whatever. So like that, and then it, the first one will go in the middle, and then it will work out its work its way out kind of thing. Do 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 like so. Now I've never actually done one of these before, so that's going to be quite interesting. Um, I've been looking at tutorials, and I've pretty much worked out how you do it, I believe. Um, so I need to make some maps and things first, so I'll be with you when I've done all that. So I think five is probably a good amount to build, uh, do, so we can have one in the middle. One, two, three, four, five, like so. Uh, actually we'll probably do it there, I'd say, and have it like that, um, and then just have some other block at the bottom there. Maybe, uh, logs or some fences or something, so it's kind of risen off the ground. So the first one will be there, we'll probably, actually, I'll put, probably put half slabs there. Build it up. Let's just do that now. That might look quite nice. Sorry, I'm getting a bit carried away here. Let's uh, like that. That kind of looks all right. It's not too bad. It looks a bit like a stage. Anyway, so um, I'm going to build the map first and then get some um, item frames. So I believe what you do is right click and then that will be the center of the map and it should do one to one. I th I'm thinking here would be a good place. Dead in the middle of the spawn. I'm not sure if this will work. One to one, but here we go. Okay, so we made a map. It says one to one, that's good. Okay, that might work quite well actually. So that's nice. So which way does it. So that's down. That's that way. Sweet, so that's actually quite good. And then you go, I believe what you do is you go off to the like unloaded areas and then you click again and then it will load that area so, so I'm going to um, make a, make some item frames put them all on the board and then I will be back with you oh thank you thank you sir see you sir thank you sir so number one uh, we'll just do like uh, that for the time being number one in there okay so now what we need to do is go God, this is confusing. Where am I on the map? I can't actually see myself. I think it'll be easier to hold it when go off and do the things. So, we want to go up that way, off into the unseen chunks. So, that is just over here. I think it, it works like that. I don't think you have to be in the center. So, if I right-click that, that should be the one to the right, or to the, to the one above even. So let's go back. This is working north, south, east, and west. So that, yeah, that's north, so it's working like that. Okay. That may be a bit confusing it being here, though. That's the problem. So like that, and then this one goes above it. God, that is a bit confusing, isn't it? Because north is up. North really should, it should be facing that way. Okay, I'm going to move this somewhere else where it's a bit less confusing. Yeah, so I'll be back with you then. So I found a new spot. About two feet away from the old one. I'm thinking here. Facing that way. 
Um, I did actually consider putting it in the spawn um, portal room, but um, the only problem with that is, you know, it's not my build. Mess Messenger built it, and also uh, the way he built it, it is um, not a an odd number, and it's the maps are easier if they're odd number in the middle because that's where spawn is, for example. So, and I don't want to go around breaking things inside there without his permission. So, uh, I think doing it up here will probably work best. Um, facing that way, facing north. This is always fun, trying to work out things in Minecraft you've never done before. Kind of takes it back to like when you first get Minecraft and you're all learning all the new physics and burning quite a bit, apparently. Let's get rid of all these. I thought I had shears on. Oh, I do have shears on. Oh, but that will give me blocks. I don't want blocks. Let's just burn these last bits because I can't be bothered to break it. So, here looks like a really, 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 really nice place. Uh, I've got some dirt on me to do a bit of terraforming. That's a sapling. How did I end up with a sapling? Well, I was trying to get dirt. Anyway, so let's sort all this out. Okay. There we go. And we're going to place it there. I think that'll look quite nice. Give me that call back. Thank you. So, blocks, 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 blocks. I think we can go with this again. Go with the... Um, Stone brick, and actually, let's make some uh, cobblestone fences. Oh, so much crap on in my inventory. Uh, what, what, I don't need sapling. I don't really need that either. Okay. So, one, two, three, four, five. I suppose that kind of works for the time being. And you know, I'm guessing we could expand it uh, in either direction. So, like, no, we'll just keep it like that for the time being. Well, okay. Just a little spin around. There we go. Put these in. Maybe, do you think wood would work better? Because this looks a bit, yeah, that looks a bit industrial. I really like that. Kind of want to keep the same style as everything else in spawn. So that kind of wood feel. Um, dark, is, spawn has, has kind of taken on the dark oak kind of side of things. Everything's quite dark. I like that. Everything looks nice. Everyone, everyone's styled things around each other. Like No one's set a style at spawn, really. Um, and then go up one more block like that. I'll probably pretty this up, make later. Pretty this up, pretty this up a bit later. Um, because it does look a bit ugly at the moment. Maybe if I did, um, yeah, actually, actually, whoa, hello, my A key got stuck. Maybe if I do this, if I just get two more stacks of sixteen, of six even. There we go. And do it around the side. That might look a bit nicer. This does look a bit odd. I'm, I'm not going to lie. It doesn't look very nice. God, yeah, I will definitely change this later. I don't have any dark uh, wood on me at the moment. So, item frames. One, two, three, four for the time being. Which one is the first one? That one. And why is it not... Does it depend on which way I'm looking? Because that way is... Oh, no, that that is right. Yeah, that is right, because yeah, cause of the um, spawn with the three pathways going off, so like... I feel like that should be lower. I really feel like that should be lower. Hmm, this is hard. I'm, I'm doing more designing of the map board than anything, to be quite honest. Alright, I'm, I'm just, I'm just going to get these first maps on the wall. Well, well, well. This is a sight to be seen. For you guys, watching this at home... There was just a simple cut, literally probably a second, but for me, there's been about a week's gap since I've sat and recorded Minecraft. If you don't know what I mean or what the hell I'm talking about, go check out my last video because that'll explain all. Um, so here we go, I'm going to log back in and this should be exactly where I logged off when my PC died, so here we go. And let's see if anything's happened. So there we are. There's it. <laughs> hey guys. And <laughs> Messenger calls me a fact. That's cool. Woohoo! Just recording at the moment. So this is insane. And I feel like something's different. Let's can turn these chunks down. So I'm, a bit, I'm lagging a bit at the moment. There's a. Uh, Okay, so let's see, let's see, let's see. So we've still got the building and some guys running around there. There's a weird tree thing that's popped up over there. Um, this path wasn't... Whoa, I found it weird then. This path 
is awesome. That's been there for a while. Ooh, oh, wow. This is new. This is really new. So there's a tunnel going off that way. It looks like people are adding more paths in. Then there's this. So this is Epic's Land. So this actually looks like someone is living at spawn. Ooh. Oh, this is cool. This is really nice. This, uh... Oh wow, that, oh, I need to make a banner. See, that's really, really, really cool. Let's have a little look down here. Let's see if anyone's uh, done anything different. Beacon room still looks pretty boring. Yeah, uh, I probably said things in the uh, the last cut that uh, basically aren't relevant, like things about the end of Dragon Fight. That never happened because, uh, oh, because, you know, my computer died. I'm going to stop saying that now because that's getting really repetitive. And of course, we're back. And there are people invisible, I believe. Hmm. No, so. The map room. The map. Look. Look at that. We've got to finish this off now. Oh, why can't I pick it up? What's happened? Okay, that's still there. Apparently I didn't pick up. Where's the other one gone? There's someone there. Oh, that wasn't to him. That wasn't to him. That was to someone's invisible. Someone is invisible. Anyway, so we had... Uh, let's try and finish off. This is going to be hard to get back into. So this was... Uh, that. So that was the middle one. And then we had this one, which was above it. So if I can try and work this out. Let's actually try and... Look, there's someone there. Look, you can see it on the map. Uh, so let's have a look. This is gonna be quite far to figure out. So that's me there. So I've done the one above. So I just need to go to the right, which is this way, and then go off the map. Uh, it shouldn't be too far. It should literally just be up this hill to about there. That's it. Uh, so let's get rid of these seeds and then do this. Uh, hey, and actually, no one's been in that unloaded area, so that's pretty cool. So let's go and place it back. I feel like I've got a herd of sheep following me. People are just following me everywhere. Uh, one above, one below, one to the side. Is that? Is that? Oh, I've done it. That's. Oh, wow! Look at that. That is really cool. Hello there. Hmm, I'm confused what's going on. I'm just going to ignore the chat while I'm recording because this is confusing. So now I need to go up and then... Okay, so that big patch of... Like, I can just do that manually, I think. I don't need to look at the map. Which is just up over the here. Hang on a minute. Almost there. Oh, this is new. That's nice. Also, it's just over here, I think. Just out the side. I really hope I don't mess this up. So I think it is out here that should be it there really should have taken them out with me GT Towers hasn't got any bigger I thought Andrew was going to go straight to world height there but it doesn't look like it's, it's uh, expanding but uh, it still looks pretty good apologies uh, for my voice I am still ill um, which sucks when you do things that involve talking um, so I'm sorry for the sniffing as well so boom oh that's cool Ooh. Oh, I can't see my base. Can I see my base? I can see something. Oh, that there, yeah, that that uh, line there, I believe, is um, the what's it called? Uh, the little bridge thing. So I've got one map left. You know what? I might try and see how many I can get uh, done of these. So I'm gonna actually cut, and hopefully, my PC won't die. <laughs> so yeah, we're gonna uh, we're gonna do a little cut here. So see you guys in a second. So I've just come over to uh, do Andrew's base to do the final bit of the map. And look how cool his base looks. It looks freaking awesome. It looks like one of those ice um, spike temples. And look at this. I haven't even realized he's done all this. And this is awesome. Look at this. Oh my god. This goes... And then does this go up again? Like up... The oh wow. He's been busy. Holy crap. So yeah, I'm going to go back to uh, spawn and finish off the final... Pieces of map.
Okay, so this is pretty much done now. Um, this is infinitely expandable, and this looks just freaking amazing. Uh, so we've got the village over here, which looks a bit different. And oh, I've forgotten to load that bit over there. That doesn't matter. Um, it looks a bit different. It looks like someone's changed the path color. Unless gray just doesn't show. Oh no, of course gray turns shows up. Anyway, so what have we got? We've got the main spawn area, which is looking freaking amazing from here. Uh, we've got base over there, we've got uh, Andrew's base, we've got my base there, which I didn't realise how freaking close it was to like the, the centre of the map. Um, but what I'm really proud of actually is how cool our base looks, it, it's quite cool, it's, uh, it's not like a classic building like here, it's spawn, it's just kind of everywhere. Um, yeah, so hopefully this will help people that are new come on the server and they'll be able to see wh where everything is. But yeah, this is the end of this episode, this is a bit weird, um, because... It only feels like I've been recording for five minutes. Wow, well, sorry for that cut there. I just had to blow my nose because I'm really ill still. Um, yeah, so thank you very much for watching this episode. If you did enjoy it, leave a like and comment down below. And then subscribe so you never miss an episode. Thank you very much for watching. And I'll see you next time.